This video shows a step-by-step -step procedure for repair of deteriorated piles using Formatube. The items you need for a typical installation include Formatube strips, spacers, skirt pins, nylon banding and connectors, tensioning tool, foam strip, hose, and duct tape. Pass several skirt pins through a piece of nylon banding and position them uniformly around the pile. Using a connector and the tensioning tool, secure the banding tightly around the pile. Spacers can be used to set a uniform standoff distance around the pile and position the Formatube jacket symmetrically around the pile. A unique feature of Formatube is that it allows you to make your own jacket of any diameter and length on site. By staggering the joint locations, you can make long jackets with shorter pieces. Here, a 3 foot and a 1 foot long piece are placed next to a 4 foot long piece, followed by two 2 foot long pieces. Use as many strips as needed, keeping in mind that each strip increases the diameter of the jacket by 2 inches. Here, we use 8 strips to create a 16 inch diameter jacket or tube. It is recommended to place a piece of duct tape across the back of the strips. This will prevent the strips from sliding while you handle them. The last strip can be either slid into place or gently hammered in using a mallet. To seal the bottom of the jacket, a piece of foam can be shoved into place. A pleated piece of plastic can also be attached to the pile, folded over the jacket, and secured with a nylon band. Like a diaper, this will prevent any grout or concrete from falling into the water. To help resist the pressure of the wet grout, ratchet straps can be temporarily wrapped around the pile. Alternatively, you can wrap the jacket with shrink wrap. This will not only provide additional support, but it will also keep the exterior face of the jacket clean during the grouting operation. The grout can be placed using the Tremie method. You can hang a weight, such as a vice grip, to the end of the hose to make sure it stays down. The grout is mixed and placed by hand, or a pump. Make sure the end of the hose always remains in the grout, and you gradually pull it up as the grout is introduced. This will prevent mixing of the seawater with the grout. The unique protruding T-profiles of Formatube provide a strong bond between the jacket and the grout. Lastly, the top surface of the grout can be finished with a slope and coated with paint or epoxy to allow rain and water to run away from the pile. To learn more or place an order, visit formatube.com.